Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Load Nose. All right, so today I'm gonna to show you how to open up another audio editor within Vegas Pro. And well, why would you wanna do this? Well, as fantastic as Vegas Pro is for its video functions and audio editing functions. Uh, me personally, sometimes I feel that it's audio editing functions can be a little clunky and cumbersome. I, I, I really don't do a lot of EQing within Vegas Pro or any, just, yeah, I try to stay with it. It just can be a pain in the neck sometimes. Okay, so, and and there are other, there are other audio editing programs that I prefer to edit my audio in. So to, for this example, today I'm gonna use Audacity. Um, and especially when I'm doing things for video, I'm doing very minor EQing. So Audacity, Audacity is good to just clean up, clean up my audio, add up any kind of add up, add any kind of small EQing or compression that I may need to do, or maybe just sound clean up or normalizing. Um, okay, well, you know. All right, so let's get straight to it. Uh, first off, let's go to first. We have to set up your audio editor. So go to options, go to preferences. You want to go to audio, and where it says preferred audio editor, you can actually you actually you can actually link the executable file of your audio editor. That can be um, uh, what's okay Audacity. Um, what's the other one for freaking the, this cloud Audition? Is it Audition or Audition or whichever preferred audio editor uh, program uh, you want? So once that is set up, once you go to the installation file and you link uh, the executable file, you're good to go. Then you go to a piece of audio. That you actually go to the audio track or piece of audio that you want to that you want to manipulate or open with any audio editor. Okay, so I'll take this piece of audio in itself. Not everything you're gonna do. Okay, so I okay, so I did the audition itself, sent it off just all right. So I am going to right click the actual file. Okay, and I am going to do open copy in audio editor. Okay, so I, I will do that. And what that does. I'll back up in a second, but when when it brings up this option, you want to do read the files directly from the original from the original because because of the option that we just did previously, how we did open copy and audio editor, Vegas Pro made a copy of the file that we are going to edit. Okay, so we're not we're not going to manipulate the actual original file. We are working with a copy file, and if you look right here, it actually says right here vlog twelve take two. That is the copy of the file that Vegas Pro did, and it, and it threw it right here into our Vegas, into I'm sorry, into our um, Audacity session. So okay, so I did the audition itself, sent it off. Just same thing. Let me go over here. Okay, so I did the audition. Same same audio. All right, so now here we can actually play with our audio and do whatever kind of adjustments that we want to it. So let's have some fun. Please. Vive. Uh, let's go ahead. Let's go to our effects and let's go ahead and throw some um, Let's go. Let's throw some cool reverb reverb on okay, it Okay, so I did the audition itself sent it off just in time. It's only about like a day and a half time that you had to submit uh... Okay, let's okay that it uh, apply our reverb Bye for biz then what you want to do now is go to file you want to export your audio and then you want to save you want to save the file that's in Audacity, and you want to save it into the folder that you're working on uh, within Vegas. So vlog 12, take two, that's the actual file, that's the copy. We're now going to re record over that copy. Okay, and of course you want to leave everything the same. Yes. Okay. All right, and then we go back to our uh, to Vegas and okay so I did the audition itself sent it off just in time it's only about like a day and a half time that you had to and there you go now for shits and giggles <coughs> so I'm like whoa oh, yeah whoa all right so uh so what if we don't use the open copy and editor all right well you can we can always use this open and audio editor okay once that opens audacity audacity would give you the option do you want audacity to make a, a copy of the file or would you want to read from the original file and, and just destroy it right there. It, it, it all, it's all up to you. It's all depending on your workflow and whichever uh, moves fastly for you. So I've already done this, uh, the, the video that you're seeing here. So I'll go ahead and just do that. It brings it in. Oh, again, this is the full entire one. Okay, so I did the audition. Okay, so I... Oh yeah, look at that. This, like, well, turn <clears throat> over there. Okay. So let's see how it is. Oh, so this is probably gonna affect the entire session, the, the entire session of the entire, yeah, yeah, okay, I wanna see this happen. I mean, besides, besides the, effect, the, uh, the actual clip that I selected, since I didn't make a copy of it, it's affecting the entire file, 
it might affect everything. And this this file is actually like a half an hour long, so it should affect both video videos. Okay, so what do we want to do here? Um, let's see. Do you want to uh, let's throw some uh, let's throw some echo. Uh, the other one's a reverb. Now we're gonna throw an echo. You see. You see, you see, but I'm uh, needed, uh, needed, uh, needed by five people. By five. I, that sounds freaky, but we're gonna try it anyway. Export audio. Log two. Yes. Ooh, I'm scared. I mean, that, that, this is gonna take over the actual thing, but nah, you know, we're doing it. We're doing it for the YouTube vid, right? Okay. And now here we go. Hey, look at that. It affected that one. Figure so out what the next thought is. We're not trying to figure out what. Look at it. Affected the actual actual track. We actually did it here, but now the audition the part the audition. and the actual it's affected. And over here. And then we start doing everything and line by line. By oh, oh, that's yeah, awesome. Studio. That's awesome. That's awesome. That means we, I can do everything at once, and then it just it just affects everything. I could do that for normalizing, uh, noise reduction. Uh, removing any kind of unwanted noises. That's freaking awesome. All right, guys. So that's how you use another audio editor within Vegas Pro. Super easy to do, super helpful. Um, if you have any questions about it, go ahead, uh, hit me up. I'll, um, I'll let you know if you, if, if there's some kind of confusion with it, confusion with it, but, but that's it. Um, okay guys. So if you found this video helpful, go ahead, please leave a like, I'm always making more videos just like this. So go ahead, subscribe. So you don't miss those videos. Join the sort of, the sort of, you know, sort of, sort of, sort of community, uh, Facebook, Instagram, uh, and Twitter, low nose, sort of, and, 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 and keep hanging around. Uh, let, let mom, let grandma know about what low nose is doing. That was a joke. Um, all right guys. So until next time, I hope this video helped you out. I will see you in the next video. Bye.